Hello, everyone. Uh, biggest challenge is uh, uh, they're fast, really fast, and uh, I think they're coming together as a team. So it's, uh, it's going to be another challenge for us, and and just uh, it's all about us right now. So we just got to be consistent in all aspects of the game, and then just get it, get it rolling. You think they're coming together after they just came up? Huh? You think they're coming together after they just came up? Huh? I think they're uh, they're making new moves with the uh, with the quarterback change. So. Uh, it's any given Saturday, so we just had to play. It's all about us, like I said. So we just had to play it consistent and let the game play how we how we how we needed to. Your coach talked about evaluating everything after that game. How much offensively do you think they'll be different? Uh, honestly, I I don't know yet. I, I need to watch uh, more film on them and and be able to uh, to compare the the quarterbacks and see how. How much? Because I know they have a good uh, offense coordinator from uh, University of Arizona, so I think they're gonna they're gonna use a spread, and so that's something we need to work on on defense. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Come out with a, a little bit of a chip this week after having lost the way you did up uh, in Nevada. Oh uh, yeah, always after a loss, there's a chip on the shoulder, and um, we uh, we didn't win the physical battle. And, that's a big key in uh, San Diego State football is we want to be the most uh, physical team on the field. So uh, there's a big chip on our, sh our shoulder, and we just we need to get back to what we know best and to be the most physical team. None of our team is happy about that loss. We don't take losses lightly here. Um, and we had, a, we had a really high intense practice yesterday, and we'll be ready for this game. Colin, what's the uh, reaction on the team to Christian being able to come back and play some this um, I don't think the team team knows much. I didn't I didn't know until just uh, recently that we're playing both. Um, I trust both quarterbacks, and I think they both do a very good job. So um, I'm okay with whatever happens. We're just gonna go make plays as a receiving core and uh, run the rock. I know you caught touchdown passes from both guys. You're probably happy with both. What differences do you see when each guy Um Agnew runs the ball really well. Um, Chapman throws a nice soft ball, um, very, very catchable. And uh, I think they both just did a really great job. So whatever whatever we decide to go with, I think is going to be a, a good decision. Uh, just effort to the ball. If we get all 11 hats to the ball, it creates opportunity to cause turnover. And if you put a helmet on every part of the uh, the, the ball carrier, it's gonna it's gonna have a chance to pop the ball out. Uh, so I think we just need to have more effort as a unit. There's a lot of times in the game where we thought that the running back was uh, the ball carrier was tack was tackled and we let up. And uh, if we all ran to the ball and just continue running to the ball, we'd have uh, more opportunities to pop the ball out. So it's all it's all it comes down to effort. Cole, could you give me your thoughts on Ryan Agu and the job he's done since he stepped in for Christian? Um, I think he's done a really really good job. Um, he's been through a lot of a lot of tough situations, and he's gotten us through a lot of tough situations. There's a lot of games where if he didn't make some plays right at the end, um, we might not have won those games. Uh, we've been in close. Every single game we've had has been close, and and he's done a great job so far. I mean, I think Ryan said afterwards that the battle wanted it more than you guys. How, how do you how do you avoid that? I mean, obviously you go in there, you want to win a game, but when you said the team wanted it more, how do you avoid that? Uh, I think when we when we started the game, we had a lot of fire and energy, and uh, we got complacent. We got. Uh, we got too comfortable with the lead, so we kind of let up. To uh, we let we kind of just got just distracted and thought it was going to be easy win. Uh, I didn't really feel it in the locker room at halftime. I didn't really think everyone was still bought in and focused. So uh, that needs to change. Uh, we need to be able to keep it uh, keep it pressed and uh, uh, impose our will for all four quarters of the game. And that's something that I don't think as a team we've done this season. And we have the opportunity to be a great football team if we do.